class, today's character is the math magician. <laughs> All right, so uh, we're going to be doing some ellipsis work regarding this problem. If you have any questions, please ask. No need to protest this time. <laughs> oh yeah, very good. Peaceful, peaceful, very nice. And, uh, and uh, hopefully it'll work. Okay, so are you ready? Yeah! yeah. yeah. Ready? Yay, Bob? Yay, Bob! Very good, love it. Okay, so let's start a problem that is an ellipse, gives us the major axis 20, the minor axis 6, and the center of 4, 2. Let's graph it, and let's get the equation, and let's get the foci. Those are the goals. So we can actually start this graph very easily. So if this is center 4, 2, all right, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, here, and uh, major axis is 20, minor axis is 6. So right now, we don't necessarily know if this goes left or right yet, do we? We don't know if it goes like whether this ellipse is this horizontal or whether this ellipse is vertical, right? There's one piece of information that I left off. What piece of information on your paper is left off on the board? It's parallel to the y. What's parallel to the y-axis? 20 units. Major axis. Major, Major axis. axis. Right at home. Major <coughs> axis parallel to y-axis. So where's the y-axis? Where's the y-axis? The vertical. The vertical one, right? So this is the y-axis. And the major axis is parallel to the y-axis. So how far up and down am I going? 20. 10 units. 10. Good guess. Oh, yeah, 10. 10 up and 10 down. 10 up and 10 down, indeed. So here we go. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, there. All right, pretend I went 10. <laughs> 10 up and 10 down. 1, 2. So there's 8 left here. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. No, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. There we go. And we're there. So, and then minor axis is 6, meaning left and right. How far? 3. 3. Good. 3 here. And 1, 2, 3 here. So what's this point? Do you know? Seven. So I'm going to park four two seven, here. Four, four, seven, seven, two. Seven, two. Seven, seven, two. Seven, two. One, two. One, and two. And then one, two. Very good. One, two. And we went up ten, so that we went from four, two to what? Seven. Four, seven, four, ten. Two. Fourteen. Four, oh, excuse me. Four, four, twelve. Oh, four, four, <laughs> four, twelve. Four, twelve. <laughs> and then we went down from four, two. Four, four, negative, four, negative, four negative, negative, eight. 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 All right, let's draw this in the red. So you can call this my hieroglyphic. You need like a, like a person here. Yeah, the candle. There you go. Now I'm a pharaoh. It needs to be inside the pharaoh. No! <laughs> it's like the shield or whatever. Anyway, <laughs> okay, so length of the major axis here, length of minor axis there. So let's go ahead and uh, see if we can do the equation of this ellipse. <coughs> right? I'm doing I'm squaring one, plus or minus? Flat plus. plus always. Squared. Now we can do x what? Minus, minus, four. minus four. 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 And then y minus That's the two. center. And y minus, minus two. two. Very good. My headdress is very royal. This thing rides up though. It's funny. <laughs> <laughs> they don't teach you that in Pharaoh school. <laughs> okay, and now notice it's a elongated vertically. So which one has more influence, x or y? Y. 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 So what would this be, you guys? Negative 8. 10 squared. 10 squared. 10 squared. So, Why is that so this squared? is 100. Because do you agree that the major axis, do you agree that this is A here? Yes. And do you agree that this is A as well? 
Yeah. So major axis, <laughs> major axis is 10, or excuse me, 20. I'm going to erase it. Here we go. So if that's 20, and we know that this is a squared, and that's just one of them. One of them. Yeah. Okay. Okay, and now if anyone knows it, feel free to call it out. Nine. Nine. That's right, because we want three here. We try. And three here. And now foci. Does it matter the placement um, in the equation no. of where? Not really. You know why? Because if this is plus, it doesn't matter if y squared goes first and x or x squared goes second or whatever. Because it's plus. Does Naturally it equals one. Question again? Okay. Does it always equal one? It does always equal one, yes. Ellipses, uh, their root equation always equal one. If not, then you divide by whatever number is here to get this to one. Very good. Now let's do the equation to find the focal distance. Do you recall that equation? C squared. C squared. Equals, equals A squared a minus, squared minus B squared. A squared minus B squared. Very good. Cap. <laughs> All right, and what's A in this case? Um, 100. 100. Minus nine. nine equals C squared, which is ninety one. So what's C? C square is ninety one. Square ninety one. Square of 91. Right. Good job. Good job. Technically speaking, it's plus or minus the square root of ninety one, and that's for a reason. Now look at our graph. I highly recommend again, graph as soon as possible, because now you know that the foci will be on the major axis. So are the foci going left or right, or are they going to be up and down? Up and down. Is it always on the major axis? Always on the major axis, yes, always. So you find where it's longer, and you say, generally speaking, it's going to be right around here and here. So let's see if we can get those equations. OK. Now, if we go here and we go up, how far up are we going? How far up are we going from here? Uh, We're going up. This distance is always C. The focal distance is always C. That's what C stands for. It's a focal distance, a focal length. So how far up from here are we going? Square root of 91. That's right. And that means that one of these values didn't change. Which value didn't change if you go up? The 4. four. The, x, the x, x value. Correct. So I'm already just going to put 4 here. And if I go down, how far down am I going? Negative square root of 91. Negative square root of 91. That's right. Did my x change here also? No. No. OK. Now I start at what value for y? 2. 2. And I go up the square root of 91. So that's one focal point. So the other one is 2, two minus, minus the square root of 91. And the reason why we leave it is because we want to leave it elegant. The square root of 91 is like 9 points, I think. But uh, that's basically the idea. How it goes. Any questions? Protests, riots, anything? You want me to go to Shamil Sheikh or something? <laughs> <laughs> Pyramids, good job, you guys. Give yourselves a hand. Yeah.